I'm James Chow with the China Current. From the hand plow to auto irrigation systems, the challenge of feeding a growing population has forced tech and science to new front lines. As innovation expands, artificial intelligence is a new seed that's been firmly planted. And where else would AI meet agriculture than in the nation with more people than any other? In China's coastal province of Fujian, poultry farms have been supplied with leg bracelets that track the physical activity of each chicken. Now this is interesting. We've all heard of health apps and counting steps, but it's not only for humans. If the number of steps falls below the daily clustered average, the chickens are removed to check for potential illnesses. This eliminates the need to patrol the farm, looking for signs of sickness among the flock. And here's another innovation. Up north, rice farmers have installed smart sensors that track irrigation needs in real time. Rice paddies require constant flow of water, and knowing exactly when and where to deliver water can save farmers operational costs. And with the home of the world's largest pork farming industry, livestock need to be closely followed. That's why numerous pig farmers are using facial recognition technology to identify, track, and feed their pigs. This combination of tech is bringing cutting-edge innovation to even the most rural farms. Better tech means better access to food. The pandemic has shown the world how quickly food insecurity can become a pressing issue, and many are now turning their attention to innovation as a solution. Advancements in agriculture technology can help alleviate waste, eliminate excessive costs, and produce high yields. Proper nourishment is an essential human need, one that has sparked and necessitated innovation. As humans continue to harvest the benefits of yesterday's inventions today, it's only right that we continue to do our best to ensure even greater security for all, everywhere, by looking to the future of farming and food. I am James Chow. You're watching the China Current. Follow us on social media at the China Current.